are you all doing? In this video, we are going to talk about the iOS 15.4 Beta 2, when Apple is going to release this update to public and what all is expected to arrive in this update. My name is Jay, you are watching Tech Hyped. If you are new here, consider hitting that subscribe button because we are really close to 10k and I keep doing these kind of videos for you guys almost daily and I don't want you guys to miss those. Let's get right into today's video without wasting any more time. Alright, so consider that Apple may be on a one week cycle. See, we haven't really got the beta 2 as of now. The recording of this video is on 2nd of February. It is Wednesday today. It marks the one week release of iOS 15.4. And I would actually expect Apple to release the beta 2 of iOS 15.4 today. Yes, the day I'm uploading this video. Now, how cool is that? How cool is that? Oh my god, I'm so damn obsessed with this clip of Craig Federighi saying, How cool is that? <laughs> Damn, I know you guys are obsessed with it too. Anyways, talking about more new changes that are expected to arrive in this update. See, we can't really judge every single thing and talk about every single new feature that will be coming up. This is not confirmed at all. It may be that Apple is on a two-week cycle, so we may not even see this update this week. It may be that we will see it in on next Tuesday or next Wednesday. So we just gotta wait and watch. Let's see what Apple is going to do because see, Apple is just being really really unpredictable and confusing this year first they said that 812 uh, enabled devices devices with 812 chip will be getting every single feature of ios 15 but uh, i mean that's not really right as of now the recording of this video uh, the beta one has the mask id feature and uh, the mask id feature is not really available on the 812 a13 devices which is the iphone 11 iPhone XR, XS and all those devices so that claim is false actually but if it is actually not false if you want to prove yourself Apple you gotta get on the track and uh, maybe give iPhone XR, XS, XS Max, iPhone 11, 11 Pro series maybe that mask ID feature what do you say I think so that the feature is actually present in the code of iOS 15.4 on iPhone XR and all those devices just that it is not enable for some reason i have no clue i'm seriously so damn confused and i know you guys are really confused too so fingers crossed hope so we will see this feature arriving on our older devices too i don't think so it will be a thing on iphone 10 series because come on it is an a11 bionic chip device so i don't really think so that even if uh it does get that feature it will be fast enough because i have seen a lot of people struggling with face id on iphone 10 right now like there are a lot of my friends who have bugged face id and face id is being really slow on the iphone 10 come on it's half a decade old phone we can't really complain that much if they didn't uh, add that feature on the iphone 10 but at least at least on the iphone 11 10 r and all those devices please apple at this point i'm not even talking about new wallpapers oh wait yes <laughs> i'm crying bro apple what are you doing please give me some new wallpapers i really want some new wallpapers and i know you guys want some new wallpapers too don't worry i have some of my favorite wallpapers linked in the description by my favorite creators and all so gotta give credits to all of them i use their wallpapers on my devices almost daily and uh, yeah, they, their wallpapers are just amazing. So you gotta click on the link and check their wallpapers out. Hope so. Fingers crossed. Apple will be coming out with new wallpapers on the beta 2 of iOS 15.4. At this point, I I'm not saying that. I'm pretty sure. All right. I'm just not sure even 0.01% at this point because come on i have been proven wrong so many times i have had this feeling that apple will add new wallpapers every single time they release update but guess what they have still not added any new wallpapers craig federici please do something my god how cool is that anyways there are a lot of bugs still in the ios 15.4 some of them being but number one which is really irritating is the battery drain the battery drain is just so damn horrible at least on my iphone 12 uh, on my iPhone 11, the battery bug is still horrible, but not as bad as it is on my iPhone 12. For some reason, my iPhone 12 is just so bad on iOS 15.4 battery 
uh, drain thing. It is just draining battery so damn quickly. Same is the case with my iPhone XR, but uh, we can't really complain that much because come on, <laughs> it's beta one. So let, we gotta wait. Smart suggestions and the smart widget is bugged too for me. Sometimes it does not switch when I want to and uh, uh, it happened to me yesterday when I was trying to switch between those. I was just swiping between them and my phone got a respring. So yes, these are the things which are normal when you are on a beta software. So just don't be really scared if you do notice these things. It is normal. It is normal. Just complain about that in the feedback app. There is nothing a lot that you can do about it. Well, that's pretty much it for this iOS 15.4 preview of beta 2. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know down in the comments below what all features and changes you want Apple to add in the future and uh, on the beta 2 of ios 15.4 i will be reading all of them and replying to you guys be sure to subscribe because we are so close to 10k i want to get to 10k as soon as we can so thank you so much if you have subscribed and if you haven't please do it thank you so much for watching and i will catch you guys in the very next episode peace